thing to start with is a long-term rental is a lease that is 12 months or longer. A midterm rental is usually furnished. It is 30 to 90 days, and it is for things like traveling nurses, people that are going somewhere to receive health care. It's for somebody to go take care of their parents' estate while they go clean out the house, that kind of thing. So they're coming in. They don't have anyone to, or they don't want to um, stay at mom and dad's. Maybe it was a 55 plus community. They're not allowed to be there. So they'll, they'll rent something for longer than 30 days at a reduced rate. And what do you mean by furnished? Just so fully furnished. So dishes, everything, right? That's what you mean? Yep. Okay. Yep. And I will say, so like when somebody goes to rent something for longer than 30 days, they become more of a resident status and less of a tourist status. So the taxes go significantly lower. So like if somebody's looking to rent somewhere for like 22 days, if they bump that to 30, their tax rate can go down from like eight to 18% depending on the municipality. So like that tourism tax, that fee you pay to the the city, you know, you'll have a hotel and you'll have a cleaning fee and then you have this big old tax. Um, Once that rental is longer than 30 days, it goes down significantly. So that's just kind of a thing. And then short-term rental is anything from one to 30 days. So those are also furnished. Um, and that's just your Airbnb, VRBO, typical renting a house when you go out of town as opposed to a hotel. Mm-hmm. 